Hey guys, and welcome back to another Let's Play Modding Gaming video. This is episode 2 in the series. Now in today's episode, we're going to be playing a game that is similar to Diablo 4 from the Diablo series. However, this game is vastly different in quite a few ways. One, this game has multiple high resolution cutscenes. And when I mean multiple, I mean there's like thousands of them. The second is, this game is Dungeons and Dragons inspired, so there is dice rolling and there's also a narrator telling us the story as we progress in it. The third and final thing, there's probably more but let's go with three right now. The third and final thing is I'm not playing on a console which means we get to have mods mods mods. <laughs> and ever since Diablo 2 came out I used to like modify the game files and everything so that my little ice dagger would like stab and kill everyone so quickly. I'm able to do that in this game. I haven't modified any weapons, however, we do have quite a lot of mods. And I've put in about like 50 or so mods in this game, so let's get started. Now the game that we're going to be playing is called Baldur's Gate 3. Now this game is amazing. Now one of the most important mods that I put on this game was to be, instead of playing it from that top down view like Diablo, is we're able to like alter the camera and play from a third person perspective which is amazing now without any further ado let's get started okay guys so we've got the explorer difficulty balance and tactician so let's just go with balance today and let's start the game okay and it starts Now, I've only played the first minute or so of this game, just so I can see if the mods work. So, I haven't actually seen any cutscenes. I've just pressed spacebar to, like, skip everything. So, yeah. Witnessing this for the first time. Alright, so we've got, like, an orc girl. I'm guessing this is who we are. Oh, no. That must be us. Oh wow, this creature only has like three fingers and a thumb. Ew. What is that? But look at the graphics. How nice are they, eh? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Oh, yuck! Oh my god. My god, I felt like there was something going on my leg, but it's my, like, cable and everything. Uh, what's happening? Oh no, he's gonna do it to us now. Oh no, no, resist, resist. Resist, resist. Oh my god. Oh, what? Oh! <laughs> oh, I jumped. <laughs> As I said, never seen this before, so, uh, yeah. Alright. Who are we? Alright, uh, she looks alright. Um, now you're probably wondering why we're in our underwear. One of the mods is we can actually alter our, like, our weapons and everything. So, we could put a long sword on instead and all that. Yeah, so, pretty good. However, let's start from the beginning. Um, Another mod that I put is that we can be a champion. Now, this champion, uh, I, I forget what it does. It has like extra stats and bonuses or whatever. But these are the original origin characters. Now, I'm guessing this is the girl that we saw before. Um, can we take her helmet off? Where is helmet? Oh, headwear. There we go. Um, uh... Can I click it? Oh, okay, so if I click it twice, it gets rid of it. Yeah, I think this is who we saw in that cutscene. Alright, now let's just go to a champion and let's edit this person. First, let's put the race as half elf. I'm feeling a half elf today. Uh, okay, now down at the bottom over here, we've got body types. So we've got like a female body, a male body, and then these are like more buff versions. So, stronger, and that's the male counterpart, so this guy looks pretty beefed up actually, pretty jacked. 
uh, compared to this guy. Um, but however, let's play as a female character. Now, I usually like playing games as a female character because, you know, if you're going to be playing a game for like a hundred hours or plus, you may as well watch somebody that's a female than looking at uh, the back of this. It still looks like a girl. Oh, that, that is a girl. Okay. It's sort of that, you know, but um, there are some games that I do play as male characters. Um, yeah, not sure why. Anyway, let's continue. Sub race. We've got the high half elf. Okay, we've got the wood elf and then a drown. Drown? Half elf. Ooh. She looks pretty badass. I like it. Um, however, let's go with high. Um, let's do that, hey? Alright, now high elf can trip. Okay, let's just leave it to our standard firebolt. And our class warlock. Um, maybe we'll just leave it as so. How come she doesn't have clothes? Can I alter it here? Can I select other ones? Yeah, okay, so some of the characters don't have clothes. But, um, I guess that's okay. That's alright. Um, let's just go with what it was. Sorcerer. And cantrips. Okay, so we've got these four selected. Um... Uh, We've already got this as a cantrip, so yeah, we don't need that because we've already got a high off cantrip there. So um, let's get rid of this. What is this? Now nah, let's get rid of that. And what can we get in? Ray of Frost. Um, okay. And what's this? Poison spray. All right. Let's stick with those. Now, is there anything else here? Okay. Um, no. Illusions. No, I think... I think that's good. Okay. And spells. Uh, I think we should just leave it as what it is. I'm not really too sure. What's this ray of sickness? Yeah, now let's just leave it. Now, our subclass. Um, we've got wild magic. Draconic bloodline. Which I'm gonna choose, I think. And then stormy sorceress. Now look at the robes on this one. That is nice. Nice robes. But let's go with Draconic Bloodline. Oh, I wish I could have the these ones, but it's okay. Let's go with Draconic Bloodline. And our Ancestor. We've got a couple different varieties to choose from here. And you can see the little um, like attachment that comes with it. I'm going to choose the Red Fire Ancestry Dragon. Alright, uh, it gives us burning hands up to 5 meters, I think it is. So let's do that. And to be honest, I have no clue about deities at all in this game. Now, I thought tier was like as in like like God of War, you know, like that type of tier. Um, however, let's just stick with this one here. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. Corillion Larethian? Thien? I don't know. Okay. Creator of the elves. This person oversees the elven pantheon as a whole. Providing blessings to those who study art, magic, and nature. Okay. That seems pretty good to me. Uh, let's go to our background. Uh, default, it was soldier. And I was thinking maybe I want to be a criminal because the skills is deception and stealth. However, when I go to state, sage, <laughs> I should say. There is deception down here, and then stealth is here as well, but they've got so many skills. So we're definitely going to be a sage. Alright, now abilities, uh, I'm just going to leave it because... Wait, charisma is our most... That's our main primary ability, so that's got to be the highest. So yeah, everything looks fine, I guess. Alright, um, now let's edit our appearance. Now, first of all... Um, identity oh we're non-binary okay male now we're female and our voice let's go from one it's open oh. more of those wretched things okay male there's magic keeping this chest sealed so i can feel its aura two sounds all right where to next hmm what was that mm. hells something just woke up down here Two sounds a Be bit aware. better. It's opened. More of those wrecks. There's magic keeping this chest sealed. 
I can feel its aura. No. Where to next? What was that? Oh, let's hear it again. Let's hope the locals are friendly. Pals, something just woke up down here. Uh, maybe not. Be let's stick. Opened. More of those wretched things. Yeah, let's stick with this. All right. And now here's another mod. We've got different types of heads that we can choose from. Shadow Heart's head. Okay. All right. Uh, whoa. She's got no eyes. Oh. Why? Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. Okay. Mm. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Um. I don't want to. Ex experiment with the rest I guess um, okay let's go oh we can do all let's zoom out a bit oh I'm an avatar okay all right wow there's quite a lot of colors that you can choose from oh I thought that was meant to be blue Oh, her lips are blue. <laughs> okay, um, now you know what, let's go back to here. What was it? Two? Was it? Well, I just want here. Two, three. Um, yeah, that seems okay. Let's stick with that. Okay, um, no scarring and what else? Maturity. Okay. Oh, the wrinkles. We'll just leave everything there. Uh, genitals default okay oh, we can hide clothes to take a look all right now I need to make sure I censor this so no one sees okay um, okay that's what the genitals look like okay so we've got different ones to choose from I'm gonna go with vulva C <laughs> all right and then we've got the male counterparts okay um, Yep, okay, that is what it is, and let's stick with Volva C, and let's put the clothes back on, and, um, yeah, interesting game. There's another difference to this game than Diablo 4, it seems. Okay, um, I, to be honest, when I scrolled, I, I only ever knew about these ones, I always stopped there, I never actually saw the genitals bit. That's where I stopped. I'm like, oh, because you can use a scroll wheel. And I just scrolled and it was like there. And I'm like, oh, let's explore these. Let's try these out. And then, yeah, I just never just. Okay, let's move on. All right, let's go with body art. Um, what is that? Oh. Okay, um, just let's go through this character selection quickly. So let's just go through everything quickly. Um, blue. All right, let's leave this makeup, lipstick. Oh, we can make it glossy. Intensity, no, not that intense. There we go, let's confirm. All right, our hair. All right, now there is a mod that I put in that has different types of hairs. And let's zoom out so you can see all the different options that they have. Like, these are pretty nice. Um, to be honest, I wanted to have this here. It's kind of like um, alloy inspired for my for what I thought, you know. Um, however, however, um, I think I might stick with this one here, as when I was testing out the characters, uh, this is what I used, and I kind of like, I like it. I don't know why the the high ponytail, I like with the little baby hair and the the side fringes looks good to me now our highlights let's change it let's make it purple all right confirm our graying let's put that as light purple all right we can change the intensity up here um, that seems good and then our hair color is can I change that to purple no that is way too purple Mine kind of reminds me of that girl from, um, is it Ahsoka? Ashoka? Ahsoka? Ashoka? Uh, who knows? Alright, let's just leave it as blonde. What's this 
Blonde Ash. Blonde Ash? Or Blonde? Ah, uh, this actually suits the, like, the skin color. So let's go with this. Um, but I'm kind of having second thoughts on these purple. Maybe dark? Yeah, just keep it, like, hidden, eh? And then leave it as that as well. Alright, so that's our hair. Any other options? No. Alright, facial hair. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, my God. Now, that is sexy. Look at that. <laughs> Alright, let's put this on. Oh, there is no modded versions for these. <laughs> okay. Alright, uh, leave it as no facial hair. Oh, draconic bloodline. Alright. Oh, so we can change the scales or oh, all of the colors. Ooh. Okay, confirm. What are our options? Uh, you know what? I don't like it. Let's take it off. Alright, and are those freckles default? Let's go back to here. And let's go down. Our oh, freckle intensity. Okay. Our oh, freckle quantity is there. And then intensity. Okay. Alright, let's just leave it as all off. Um, she's already got freckles. All good. Okay, um... I think that seems pretty good, eh? That is our character. I hope you guys like her. Let's hit proceed. Now, default, the game's character is usually called Tav. And that is going back to when the game was in development. Um, as that's what it was going to be called or something like that. I'm not sure. Um, but that's what I read about. Um, so, she... What do you guys think? She kind of looks like a... A what? An Ashley? A Chloe? I don't know. I, I don't know. Um, let's go with Ashley. Alright, so let's proceed. Oh! I need a guardian now. Alright, so let's just choose an elf. Uh, sub race, hi. Just gonna go through this quickly. Alright, um... Uh, let's stick with this girl here. All right, voice one. Remarkable, truly. Okay, thank you. I'm remarkable. All right, anything else? Leave everything as. When do we see this guardian? To be honest, I'm not sure. Okay. Makeup. Do you want to have the same makeup as us? And your hair. Okay. Now, oh, okay, um, what hairstyle, oh no, let's put a custom hairstyle on, oh, this seems okay, alright, first custom hair cho style I chose, and you know what, um, ooh, that looks nice, she looks like a, she looks like we're gonna be the guardians for her, actually, she looks more like a princess. Alright, um, let's every leave everything else, and let's venture forth. Done and done. Oh yeah, that's right. That thing went into our IA. Okay. looks like um like England wow the 1800s or something like that seventeen hundreds or sixteen around that era oh wow oh jeez oh my god it touches you and you die Oh, no, you don't die. You get transported. Wow. 
Japanese fantasy right there, tentacle monster. Oh, dragons. Oh, are these the heroes? Oh, is this where we are? Oh, no, no, we're stuck inside that pod. That's right. So they're going to come and rescue us. Ooh. But good job. Oh, he's connected to it. Like, he did this so he can feel the pain. Ooh. Come on, dragon. Dracarys. Oh, wow. There we go. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, they can teleport too. Wait, how do they know where he was going? Or do they have like a homing beacon tracker on him? Oh, wow. Whoa. Nice stop. Man, I wish dragons were real, but how much havoc would they, like, instill in our world today? Oh. The orc girl is, like, free. Come on. Do us a solid. Free us as well. Won't. As I said, I played like a minute of this, so I know that like the pod unlocks itself, but no more spoilers. Whoa, what are those? <laughs> I was like, Baldur's Gate 3, so there's three of those things. Okay, guys, and here we are. We're at our pod. And... It looks like we're wearing a black robe. Hey, it's black, yeah. Oh no, it's green. It just looks it. Okay. Okay. Alright, so here we go. My head. <laughs> Alright, so um in this game you control the character by like pressing around. However, uh, we got a WASD mod. Uh, I always call it WSAD, but uh, it's WASD mod, where we can actually use those keys to control the character and move it around. Pretty sweet. Um, I like it. And let's go up to this thing. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. Okay, let's investigate. Alright, skill check. Now this is where we roll the dice. Okay. And because we've got quite a few proficiencies here, uh, we just need 10, but we're going to make it. 13 and an 8. Okay, so we've got an 18 already. Plus all of these. Beautiful. Alright, 57. Awesome. The casing is fragile. The slightest touch could cause it to crumble. Alright, um, it's gonna crumble, so let's just leave it, okay? And what else do we have here? Alright, so this mind flare. What's this? Onyx? Let's take all. Dead. Oops. Good. Mind flare Someone pod. Else got out. Okay. Alright, and we've got a chest here. Alright, take all of this. Alright, 
right, let's take a look at the other side. Not everyone made it out alive. Oh my god, this person like burned to death. Oh. Alright. Oh, what is this thing? Oh nothing. Oh, that's nothing. What's this? Visions project into your mind. A nautiloid hurtling through the plains, resplendent with psionic energy. Okay. So we got another onyx. Alright. Ah, and another chest. What's this? Okay. Got our gold. Excellent. Now to head down. Now, I'll just click here. So yeah, so usually you can't see up here into the world and everything. It's always just like a... I think this is as close as you can get to the game. Something like that. So it's pretty amazing like the type of mods you can have in this game. Oh, sphincter. Oh, okay. Oh my god. Alright, let's let's go let's go through the sphincter. Alright, um Ooh, another goblin? Oh first goblin I mean. You guys hear those voices? Images of goblins, their habits and histories flash into your mind. We are trapped. What the oh from up here. Okay, how do I get here? What's this? Oh. A schematic of a nautiloid flashes into your mind. Nerves, sinews, as much living being as ship. Oh, okay. A feeling penetrates your mind. An anomaly, one like ourselves, unconnected from the whole. Caution. Worlds beyond worlds flash before your eyes. Empires of a grand design traversed by ships just like this. Okay. What the heck? Oh, this guy here. Okay. Um, we'll go see him. But what's here? Oh. Can't get there. What do you mean we can't get there? Okay. Um. Okay, okay, I'll come help you. What's this? Okay. Okay. This is weird. Release you? Oh my god. How can I release you? You're dead. Oh. Ooh. Yes. You've come to save us from this place. Oh, it's the brain from that's talking. This place you'll free us. The exposed brain quivers in expectation. Please. Before they return. They return. Who? Why do you sound afraid? The enemy. So many enemies. What enemies? Oh, is it that the flying thing that you saw? Uh, yeah. The newborn. Born new from this husk. You realize you're talking oh. to an intellect devourer, a minion of the mind flayers who abducted you. Ah. Oh. Okay, um, I think you're past this point of saving, eh? Remove us from this body, from this case, free us, please. Um, okay. Uh, gently prize the brain from the skull then. Alright, let's roll for it. We need a 10. Got a 19 on our first roll. Beautiful. Now, I haven't put any dice modifiers in this, 
uh, it's just whatever my clothing is so now I wanted this playthrough to be as smooth as possible so um, hence why okay I'll hit continue oh let's watch this first the brain oh, from the skull. that sound Do you notice an opportunity you could cripple the strange creature making it more subservient should it prove a threat Okay. Mutilate the brain. Spare the creatures. Um, I think I'll just spare the creature. Yeah. Just drop him down. Don't don't touch it, man. Now don't ask me how I know this, but the human brain smells like once it's out, smells like cat piss. You know, like Something ammonia. Yeah. It's a horrible smell. The the As I said, don't ask me how I know this. And so smushy. Mm. Alright, we must go to the helm. Alright, let's go. To the helm we go. We are going to the helm. Is this guy like a fo- Oh. Ah, oh, he is gonna follow us. Oh, is he here? Oh, yes, over here. I've got a mod where, I know, I'm saying mods everywhere, where um, it like makes the whole screen like, how come it's not showing up? Okay, so over here, yeah, he is following us. Okay, all right, so he's linked to us. Okay, let's continue. What a weird creature to have, eh? All right, let's exit. Yep. Yeah, I think good hair choice. Hey! It's that orc girl that we saw before. Abomination. This is your end. Oh. Your head throbs and your Looks like we're gonna have to fight. Visions rush past. A dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Okay. My head. What is this? Skvar, you are no thrall. Flakith blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. Okay. Um, what made you think I was a thrall? We carry mind flayer parasites. Unless we escape, unless we are cleansed, our bodies and minds will be tainted and twisted. Within days, we will be geich, mind flayers. Oh, okay. Alright, so what do you suggest? First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take the control imps. of the ship. I'm guessing that's what that brain was afraid of, these imps. It will remain tame as long as it believes we are thralls. It may be of use in the fight to come. Okay. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. General tutorial combat. Okay. All right. Let's just zoom in a bit. All right. It's our turn. All right. So let's do a firebolt. Let's get rid of this guy here. Beautiful. And I guess we can go somewhere. Not far though. But uh, let's just end our turn. Okay. And I guess you can attack this thing. Alright, enter. Okay. Excellent. Uh, thank you. Some allies can join you on your adventure and you can control them the same way. Okay. Um, Alright, let's keep moving on. Now, is there anything here? Dead Thrall? 
Okay, let's just take all. Alright, what do these imps have? An axe. Is an axe gonna be good? Hand axe, take it. Alright, let's take a look at our stuff. Alright, 11 to 16. What's this? Oh no, okay. Hey, I don't even have a melee weapon. Okay, looks like I do now. Alright. So let's continue. What's this? Restoration. Oh. Ship won't be able to take another dragon attack. Not now. We must go to the helm. Alright, no worries. Sorry, I was trying to click on this person here. Ooh, some more stuff. Alright, let's take that. I think it's I to check out inventory. And um Ooh, short sword. This is better, right? And um what else do we have here? What's this? Superior healing. That's better than this one. And um simple robes. Okay, what does that look like on us? Double click? Oh, yeah, very simple. Let's stick with that. Alright. Let's... Let's go up here. Ooh, what's this guy got? Some more money? Oh, another sphincter. Oh. Let's go. Oh. And the way it opens up, man. Oh my god. Okay. I can make no sense of it. Sigil. Unleash. Aggression. Aggression. Annihilate. Unleash. Psionic energy radiates from the prisoners, but they do not react. Oh, okay. The man isn't dead, but he's totally unresponsive. Oh my god, I'm guessing they're all the same, eh? Life flickers in his eyes, but he seems totally unaware. Oh, this is a guy. Okay. Hmm. Hey, who's this in here? Mind flare pod. Get me out of this damn city! We have no time for stragglers. All right. Um. Okay. Does magic at work here? Determine what kind. All right. Let's do it. Twenty. Critical success. <laughs> nice. Warding ruins. You feel them drawing energy from the console near to the pod. Are you satisfied? We need to go. Okay, console pod. Alright, we'll, we'll take a look then. Oh, <laughs> thought this was an enemy. Alright, um, let's touch that. The console appears dormant. Okay, look for the a mechanisms switch. mechanisms are completely unrecognizable at first, but then you spy an empty socket. Ah, uh, okay. An empty socket, so we gotta fits in that look around. Power this thing. Let's go in to a third sphincter. Alright, um, another thrall. Oh, she's got a key. Ooh, is this better than what I'm equipped with? Uh, no, it's pretty much the same. Alright, let's just take it. Okay. Hey, there's another one. Oh, I can't click it. Oh, what's this? Dazed woman is trapped inside the pod. She doesn't notice you. Okay. Oh, these were the chairs before. Oh, okay. Voices. I hear nothing of the sort. Okay. Oh. Let's go. Alright, let's go this way. 
another thrall. A rune. Oh, a component to some bigger machinery. Okay, um, these boots look better. Uh, two to dexterity and armor class. Okay, holy gleaves. Let's place that. Alright, let's put those on. Oops. Alright. And another chest. Yeah, boy. <laughs> okay, so. Looks like we got everything that we need. So let's take all. Alright, and... Um, before we do anything, what does this say? Perfect. Perfect. All right, place a the hand on the console. Hand on the pod, you hear something. A presence connected to the pod, commanding the person inside to change. Change? Oh. Oh. Place your hand on the window. Bang. Oh, oh! It did place Change a hand on the window. Changed at the pull of a lever. How? If we are not purified, this may be our fate. Oh! Then preserve me. That cannot be our fate. Oh yeah! Look at him. The newborn mind flayer stares at you, weak and dazed. Oh wow! Total change. All right, now that we've got our chest of goods, our tutorial chest, um, I'm just going to modify our character a little bit and get some new armor. So I'll see you guys in a couple of seconds. Okay, guys, after all that customization, got a little bit thirsty, so time to get a glass of water. Oh, yeah. Water. Good stuff. Okay, time to go back out. And did we see this thrall? Oh, we did. Okay. Alright, now to back out through this sphincter here. Uh, uh, what's over here? Oh, another tablet, manuscript. Eight images appear in your mind. A brain, a get Yankee warrior. Get Yankee. And centuries of darkness. Okay, um, what's this? Nice. Oh, so that's what our gold key was for. Alright. Now, don't need any of these onyxes or anything. What's that? A brain jar. Hmm, okay. Okay. Alright, let's see if that thing works. The console appears dormant. Alright, insert the rune. The console hums to life. But what is its purpose? Will it free the captive, or transform her like that other unfortunate? Oh. Um, hopefully it frees her. Alright. Um, let's place our hand on the console. Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. Authority. Ah. Okay, let's will the pot open. Alright. Too many positives are created negative. However, still successful. Let's continue. You feel the biomechanical brain of the console process. Man, you gotta love mods, eh? <laughs> and yield to it. A shiver runs across your mind. Oh, it did free her. Nice. Oh. At last. Thought I was done for. Shadowheart. I thought that damn thing was going to be my coffin. Thank you. 
mind lurches into her thoughts. Her gratitude is mixed with wariness. Because you have a gith with you. Oh, a gith Yankee. You keep dangerous company. It's what we need in a fight. Fair point. Looks like there's plenty of fighting ahead. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. All right then, let's go. I'm Ashley. Shadowheart. One moment. Oh man, these guys have cool names. Oh, what's that? It's what's nothing. That? Trust me. Enough of this chatter. We need to get to the helm now. She's right. Lead on. Okay. All right, so we've rescued the captive. All right, so now our party is three and a follower. Nice. Okay, where to now? Ooh. Restoration. Okay. Ah, oh. another sphincter. Okay. We are nearing the helm. Once inside, do as I say. Who put you in charge? I'll trust my own judgment. Kane Yank. Okay. Kane Yank and something Yank. I forget the other one. All right. Okay. Ooh. That's not a way to go. Get him, Imps. Oh. Draw. Impressive blast. Connect the nerves of the transponder. We must escape. Now. Do it. We will deal with the Geich after we escape. Connect the nerves. Nerves. We will connect them. Oh, okay. We need to get out of here now. All right, it is our turn. Okay, now we've got all these extra powers and everything. Uh, take a look at this. This is my favorite move right here. Um, kill everything in one go. Wow. Nice. All right, so let's go through. Oh, this guy became our enemy. Wait, what did we hit? Oh, okay. Oh, is it these things here? Oh, sweet. Our extra move. All right. Let's get him. Oh, he's not dead yet. Hey, I've got my other one. Nice. All right, awesome. Oh, there's two new guys here. Anyway, let's end my turn. Let's finish this. All right. Um, where are they? Are they out here? Oh, they are. Okay. Um. Ah. Uh, okay. So they're right here. No worries. What's that? Okay. Let's use this. Okay. They're all taken care of. Now we can go through. Oh, there was a trap there. It's clear. Hurry before they strike. Okay. Where's the trap? She mentioned it. Uh, I can't see it. Anyway, uh, let's get rid of these guys here. There's all my projectiles. Bang. Destroyed, beautiful. The Helm's alien transponder. You made it in time. Oh. Whoa. All right, looks like all that we did was for nothing. Oh, I thought they would have withered away. We're gonna fall.
fold out, aren't we? We got it. Alright. So where are we? Oh. gonna come and find us, huh? Oh jeez! <laughs> oh my god! We're gonna die. <laughs> oh! What stopped us from falling? Or who? I guess we'll find out, eh? Oh, it's daytime now. Alright. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. All right, let's check ourselves Other for injuries. Than the infection, you're more or less intact. A miracle, given everything you've been through. But it'll all be for nothing if you don't find help soon. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. Okay. And here we are. All right, so... Look at this world, man. It's amazing. And you want to be able to see it from this view. You'll just be able to see it from, like, probably that close. Like that. Or maybe that, yeah. This view. Alright, so... Water. Nice. <laughs> Let's continue. Oh. Oh. Who's this? Oh, Shatterheart. Oh, it's that cube thingy looking thing. Alright, let's wake her up. Mm. <laughs> That's alive. the way. Shake her. Alive. How is this possible? Oh, I was hoping you might know. I remember the ship. I remember falling. Then nothing. Okay. Alright, do you have any idea where we are? I don't recognize this place. But anything's an improvement on where we just came from. First things That's first. That's true, I guess. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. Hmm, okay. Alright, we, so you want to stay we together? Need each other, and we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. Okay, let's go. One thing, just before we go. I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. I'll remember that. Lead the way. Okay. All right, so here we are. All right, um, let's continue. All right, what's in this barrel? Oh, what's this? Highlight nearby items, making it easy to find loot. Press left alt to highlight locatable. Uh, press left alt to highlight lootable containers and items. Okay, um, let's grab some water. So left alt, huh? Hey, there's a backpack here. Anything of use? Oh, see, I wouldn't have noticed that. What's this? A hat. Okay. Uh, don't need one of those. And there was something else. Ooh, a devourer. Dead fisher. 
No traps, please. Money, nice. All right. Um, this, nothing. Hey, okay. Are there anything here? Shanties for the bitch queen. Fresh water. <laughs> what there the must heck? Be a somewhere nearby. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. And what's in this? Let's take it all. Whoops. Okay. Let's continue. Oh, great. Locked door. Hey, there's a barrel here. What's this? Disarm trap toolkit and thief toolkit. Nice. Things that I need. Uh, waypoints. We discovered. Oh, is that what that on the wall is? Okay. Uh, take all. Man, I keep escaping the main menu. Alright, and... Easily. It's locked. Maybe there's another entrance. Oh, we can pick it. Alright, didn't we just receive something like that of the sort? Um, okay, and here we are. Thieves toolkits. Alright, nice. So can I add it to my action bar? Oh my god. There. There we go. Alright. Okay. So click this, Couple click that. Should do it. Okay. Wow, look at that. Total bonuses. 266. Alright, let's do it. No, luckily we got all of these. Nice. Success. Alright, let's continue. Alright, use thieves tools. Okay. Oh, so there's a trap here, huh? Can we disarm it? Nice. Excellent. Successful. Nice. All right, so now that it's disarmed... Um, what's going on? All right. What now? Why am I... Why is it controlling like this? Oh, I'm in turn-based mode. Oh. There's stuff going on here. Breathe deep. This place wasn't built for the living. It looks like a trap there. Alright. Okay. So the trap here. Can we disarm it? Oh, great. One of these things, huh? Okay. So this is disarmed. Okay. And what about the other side? I'm sure there's stuff there too, eh? Man, there's so many... Huh. Alright. Um... Can we disarm this? Okay. Excellent. Nice. Success. Awesome. Alright, now that it's disarmed, I'm gonna engrave key and a, a weapon. Alright, let's get out of here. Heavy door. 
Um, I What's see a chest here? here. Oh, just a ring? Uh, no use to me. Oh, there's another chest here. A chalice and a cup. Let's take them. Oh, there's another one over here. Oh. Okay. There's a door. Man, where are we going, eh? Alright. Oh, wait, don't I have a key? I've got a key, right? Alright. Can this work? No? A gold key? Okay, looks like we can't use any of that. Um, so, we just have to go back then, eh? Wait, nothing else here? Candles? What happens if we light all of these? Does something happen? Anything else? No. Alright. Alright, time to head out. Nothing else here. Alright. So in this dang crypt. Heavy oak doors. Ah, this is what the engraved key is for. Okay. Armed scribes. Oh. But no sign of a struggle. Let's light this brazier. The was so subversive about their words that they commanded protection. Let's go into here. This looks like a trap. Looks like someone wanted to bury their secrets. Oh, there's a chest. Okay, scroll of protection from evil and good. Okay, let's take that. Um Sarcophagus? Skull bone. Okay. Ooh, soul coin. These coins can power infernal engines. What's an infernal engine? Strange coin. Let's grab that. I what it's worth. Um You know what? I don't know if these skull and bones are worth stuff, so like if they're needed. Alright, chasm, huh? Alright, and that's it from this room. Let's head out. Hey, there's a person that just Let's have a dropped. Look. Let's take a look over here. Oh, there's a chest too. Okay. Dagger. Let's take it. Let's take a look at this. Oh. More chalices and cups. Alright. Um, let's go down to this deity thing. Can we click it? No. Oh. Scribe of the dead. Wait, Didn't think religion check. Him. Huh? Ah, oh, scribe of the dead, huh? Hey, there's a button here. Oh, man. Okay. Alright, did I do this from the wrong way? Alright. We're advantage. outmatched. You can always flee a fight you would rather. Couldn't read it, so I'm your all in. Alright, let's use this magic barrage. One here. I can use one there. Uh, I don't know if I can get this guy from here. Uh, let's just 
do it there. I, I don't think I could get him. And then there. Okay. And is that everyone? Oh, there's a guy right here. Alright. Um, I think that's everyone covered. Unfortunately, this guy is still alive. Um, can I get the brazier? No. Alright. Uh, I'll just put it here. There we go. Alright. Uh, at least that got rid of mostly everyone. Alright. Uh, let's end my turn. Um, Shadowheart, there's nothing you could do. Let's just stay here. Let this guy get closer. Entomb Scribe, huh? Alright, and... Ah, oh, see, I need to move a bit closer. Have to keep going. Here. And now I can shoot this guy. There we go. All done. Oh, now I'm back to um, third person. Alright. And I'm invisible because I killed something. Okay. Of effort to hide one sarcophagus. That's true. Okay, what's this? The Amulet of Lost Voices. Alright, the dead holds no secrets from... The people of doom. Grease bottle. Alright, let's take it. Alright, let's read this plaque first. Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. Okay. Richly adorned sarcophagus. Let's open it. He's a lot. I knew it. I knew it. I knew somebody was alive in there. Oh, jeez. The boss. Wow. A necromancer. So necromancer. Necromancer. Spoken. Which one? And so thou oh. standest before me. Right, as always. Wait, what a curious way to awaken. Who are you? Now, I have a question for thee. Okay. What is the worth of a single mortal's life? Ooh. Okay. So he has spoken. What he are you talking about? An Still. arbiter of certain matters. But that is not important now. Wilt thou answer my question? Okay. Okay, yeah, so ask away. I ask again, what is the worth of a single mortal life? Okay, the worth. Alright, no one's life is worth more than others. We are all equal. Depends on the person's deeds. Life's only value is a currency. Each life is an infinite value of merit, merit sacrificing everything for. Um, let's go with one. No one's life is worth more than others. We're all equal. Uh, I hope that's the right answer. In death, that is so. Very well. I am satisfied. Oh, nice. We have met, and I know thy face. We will see no each other are. again at the proper time and place. Farewell. How long has it been? Okay. So he's not in my party. Okay, bye. Okay. And so that was interesting. Wait, can I talk to you again? Where are you going? Parchment and bone dust. Still comforting after all this time. <laughs> we have nothing more to discuss. Continue on my way. As if I were not here. 
I must attend this place after so many years away. We will see each other again. Soon. Okay. Soon is rather vague. When exactly? When the time is proper. I do not know that hour any more than dost thou. But I do know that the longer thou standest here, the farther away our second meeting becomes. Hmm. That makes sense. Okay. Um. All right. Let's go this way then. What's over here? Um. Okay. So. I'm guessing nothing's there. Oh. <laughs> Okay, I can see a ladder here. Oh, and then he's a lever. Alright, let's climb up. Okay, so here we are at the top. So we're finally out of that cave. Wow, look at the succulents in that. So high resolution everything in this game. I love it. Alright, can we climb these vines? Yes, we can. All right. Survival. What's this? No use digging with my bare hands. Oh, so there was a trap there, huh? Oh my god, everything's trying to kill us. All right, so many traps. Bet you there's another trap here, eh? Something over there. Oh, it is another trap here. Don't oh, fancy man. getting my hands dirty. I need a All shot. right. Um. Oh, that's where we came from. Just over there. Okay, and then we came through that door down here. Alright, uh, let's continue. What's over here? Um, what's here, actually? Oh, there's people. You both twice as tall as me, but I'm half the bloody backbone! But we don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? What thing? I'm telling you, it's a ship, and the crypt can wait. Mari and Bart oh. have been trying to break in for days. Now we stop. We've been in that crypt. Got ourselves competition all right. Looks like we got the prize already. That's our ship. Okay. Uh, that ship is full of monsters. I want to go near it. All right. Uh, let's do that. Use persuasion. Alright, nine. And lucky we got all these. Excellent. Alright, success. Awesome. Well, uh, in that case, come on, you lot. No point in getting killed. Second worm gets the cheese and all. Um, second mouse gets the cheese, no? Nobody's getting any damn cheese. Now move it! <laughs> Okay. Um, cunning when you look. I'm I guessing we uh, if we got that roll wrong, um, then we would have had to fight them, eh? Okay. Alright. Oh, what's this here? A plaque. Time and the elements have left the plaque unreadable. Okay, no worries. Oh, look at that there. Bet you can fall down that. Alright, let's move up here. Um, uh, nothing's here. Oh, I'm guessing that door to put my hands on uh, is where we came from. All right, to go back in. Everything all right out there? Um, I will just say Gimblock ran. Your friends abandoned yeah. you. I'm always were a bit soft, but I've got plenty of friends who ain't soft. Come in here and you can meet them. Sounds like a trap. Okay. It's locked. Alright, looks like we can't go in there then. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, so they set up camp here. Can we actually use them or something? Oh, wow. We can sleep. That's so cool. Um, ah, oh, okay. 
Yeah. Alright, um, let's go. Alright, let's continue. What's that? Twisted vines? What twisted vines? Oh, here. Oh, twisting vines. Uh, I'm guessing that was another trap, hey? Alright, let's go this way. Where are we? Alright, um... Let's go this way down here. Oh, that's our crash ship. Okay, oh, what's this thing here? Let's take a look. You approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. Okay, let's touch it then. <laughs> Oh, there's a hand. A hand? Gale? Anyone? Who's Gale? Um. Okay, attune yourself to the sigil magic, then bind it to quiet down. Alright, need a 7, roll an 8. Oh, we got a 9 and a 12. Awesome! Alright, success. Whatever you're doing is working wonders! Now a quick little pull should do the trick. Oh, did you see our character's teeth and eyes? They just turned black. <laughs> oh. Guessing Hello. this guy's Gale. I'm Gale of Waterdeep. Oh, Apologies. nice earring. Usually better at this. All right, no need to apologize. Are you all right? I'm shocked, but friend, it's a relief and a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Say, but I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking, you were on the Nautiloid as well. Nautiloid. Oh, that's how you say it. Ah, uh, yes, I was. And I can only assume you too were on the receiving end of a rather. Unwelcome insertion in the ocular region. <laughs> uh, go on. The insertee we speak of, this parasite. Are you aware that after a period of excruciating gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers? Oh, Process him as well. Ceramorphosis, and let me assure you, it is to be avoided. You don't happen to be okay. a cleric by any chance, do you? A doctor? Surgeon? Uncannily adroit with a knitting needle. Um, you seem to nope. know enough about our condition to realize it's beyond most clerics' skills. Most, no doubt, but I find myself hoping to be in the presence of the few. You don't happen to be one of them. Uh, I possess many gifts, but tadpole extraction isn't one of them. I can't cure our parasites. As we've established, few enough can. It's not exactly a common affliction. We're most certainly going to need a healer, and soon, too. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more and look for a healer together? Okay, sure. Looks like we've got another member most to our party. Excellent. A parasite shared is a parasite halved. Or something to that effect. Oh, but before you think you're about to embark on a journey with most ill-mannered a man, Thank you for pulling me out of that stone. It was an act of foresighted kindness, I assure you. For I have the feeling ample opportunities will present themselves for me to return the favor. I hope so. All right, so. Party line. Your party is shown on the side of the screen. Portraits to show the character's health and conditions. Drag the portraits apart to split the party. Okay, so we can just drag. Oh, link by chain. Ah, oh, <laughs> that's cool. All right, let's continue. Oh, there are people dead here. Dead goblins. 
Alright, um, goblin bow. Yep, let's take that supply pack. What about this goblin? Uh, don't want any of that. And this one. What's this? Goblins can. Hey, there's something there. What's this? A mind flayer. And it's hurt. Oh. That thing. You approach the dying monster. This is the thing that abducted you. You could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion? Compassion? Why would you feel compassion? No, we should be furious. But why is it it got a question mark? Shouldn't you? Definitely not give in to the emotion. Alright, uh, how about we just step away? You can't move. Can't think. Oh, okay. Thinking is mercifully done for you. It will be a joy to serve, to die for it an honor. It's possessing your mind, forcing you to love it. But then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. Oh. All right, um, let's concentrate on its thoughts. All right, dice roll, please. Awesome, 10. Done. Your mind's fuse, lusting for something that is gone. But then its grip claws back with a vengeance, a vice locking your mind into obedience. That doesn't sound good. to survive. And with your very body, you can provide. Oh, great. Okay, let's go with this one here. You host the blood of a mighty dragon, channel its will to resist the abomination. Alright, let's roll. Awesome, we got a 12. Done. You feel the creature's thoughts stumble against your magic, your will to resist. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Okay. Um, close those eyes forever. Yep, let's do that. <laughs> That's it. Just look away. <laughs> look away, guys. Nothing to see here. Monster. Oh, there's something over Death here. Alright, um, how do we get there? This way? Oh, there's someone else here. Okay. Hurry. I've got one of those brain things cornered. Oh, okay. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? How did he know? Anyway, easy. Stand back. There. Can you see it? Nope. Oh, just a dumb <laughs> the boar? <laughs> You're relieved until you see the flash of a dagger. Oh, yeah, put it away. You don't need to buy it. Don't we? I saw you on the ship, free, scuttling about. You're in league with them, aren't you? Those tentacle. Ah! Your mind twists. You're looking ah. out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. What was that? What's going on? So he thinks that we're one of those, like... What are they called? Trowel? Tra trowel? Tal? What are they? Alright, um, it's the Mind Flayer's worm. It connects the us. Worm. Of course. Thrall. That's what it is. A thrall. Things. Yeah, we're Some not one of those. And to think... I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. Alright, apology accepted. <laughs> A kindred spirit. Gale disapproves. My name oh, well, Gale. is Astarian. <laughs> I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Baldorian introduces... Uh, wait, what's this? Those raised in Baldur's Gate near the city well for better, for worse. Yep, let's do it. Is that so? We clearly move in different circles. So, do you know anything about these worms? 
Nope. Um, oh yes, they'll turn us into mind turn players. Into... <laughs> of course, it'll turn me into a monster. Oh. What else did I expect? I guess this guy thinks he's Although, beautiful. It hasn't happened oh, yet. That's why he wears like. If we can find like, an expert, someone that what's can it control called? these things, makeup. There might still be time. <laughs> what's it called? Eyeshadow, and eyeliner, mascara. Yeah, those three. All right. Um, you should travel with me. Our odds are better you together. Know, I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd. A herd? Isn't such a bad idea. And you seem like a useful person to know. All right. I accept. The pale elf. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, so there's the boar. All right, a scared a boar. Can we talk to it? Away! Away! We can talk to it. All right, calm down. You were all the same. Too many of my kind died because of your spears, but not me. Okay. Um, that was interesting. How are we able to talk to creatures? Okay, um, what's over here, though? Um, I bet we can jump down there. Oh, there's a tree there. Anything here? Oh, what's this? Balsam. Okay. Nice. Alright. Uh, let's go over here. Let's continue. Oh, I think we're going back. This is a shipwreck, isn't it? Oh, there's something red there. Oh, time to battle. Okay, um, where is it? There it is. Okay, um, I can't do anything, eh? Alright, let's just move here. Alright, let's just get everyone up. Oh, so this is the order at the top here. Okay, so now it's back to us. All right, so that's easy. Um, I can shoot this one. Awesome. And I can shoot this with my other weapon. Okay, awesome. And now I don't think I can use my fire, can I? Oh, offhand range attack. Oh, I can get it. Mm. Perhaps our survival isn't such a distant prospect. Okay. Um. So that's that. Um. Do they blood? Oh no. Ooh, a brain. We can use it for a potion. It looks like. This one's got nothing. All right. Um. So that's weird. Uh, we've come back around full circle. It seems. Ravaged Beach. Okay. So, we're all the way back here again. Alright, that is interesting. Alright, um, I think we gotta go this way. Take a look at our mini map. Um, we're here and we're just going around. Um, I think I press M, hey. Alright, general tutorial. This is a map of our surrounding areas. Okay, so we've explored all of this. Can we move? Ah, oh, yes, okay, so we have. Alright, uh, what is this? Can I click it? Oh, we can fast travel. Oh, thank God I pressed M for map. <clears throat> okay, so let's go up this path. Hey, there's somebody there. Oh. Oh, it's this girl. Zoru was right. Yellow as a toad, twice as ugly. <laughs> the thing's dangerous. Yellow as a toad. Leave it for the goblins to kill. And if it escapes, how will you? Oh, a guest. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. 
Her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. Oh, okay. All right. Ah, uh, deception. This creature is dangerous. Get out of here. Leave it to me. All right. We need a ten. What do we get? A twelve. Nice. Okay. Success. Awesome. She's right. Let's go. We need to check out that blast. A blast? You what blast? Shook our camp good, so we came for a look. Hmm. Okay. I'm in dire need of a healer. Where is this camp? Five. Oh yeah, fifteen. We got this. All right, success. Awesome. Northwest. Look for Nettie. Whatever your wound, she can mend it. Northwest. And be careful. Find Nettie. There are goblin traps everywhere. Oh, that's what we found. Come. They're goblin traps. Enough gawking. Get me down. All right. Say please. Never. <laughs> all right bye guys oh i can't talk to you all right all right um so where's my fire spell all right there firebolt let's get rid of it okay the tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses auspicious but the longer we wait the more it consumes my people possess the cure for this infection i must find a crash you will join me a crash careful she obviously sees your kindness as weakness. Don't let her take advantage. Okay. And what exactly is a crash? It is many things. A hatchery, a training grounds, a shelter. Githyanki protocol is clear. When infected with a gay tadpole, we must report to Augusto for purification. Okay. Alright, um... <laughs> a simple thank you wouldn't go amiss. You may as well suggest a wyvern bow to worms. The cure I offer will suffice as thanks. Isn't a wyvern like a, a very small dragon thingy? Anyway, alright, we've traveled together. You have made an ally from Kresh Kalir. Few know such fortune. Call me Lazel. I'll trust your judgment. Lazel. But I won't trust her. Not until I've gotten the measure of her. You have a sharp tongue, elf. Would that your mind proved its equal. Half elf. I suppose the finer details are lost on a creature like you. Come. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. Okay. Alright. Um, so... One, two, three, four, five. All right, so she's joined our tr um, our crew. Now, um, actually, um, I tried to before. Usually, you can only get four people to accompany you, and I've been trying desperately to get a mod to work um, in the middle of this video, which was to get like more people, and. For some reason, it's now working. It wasn't working before. Like, I can only have four. She kept on saying dismiss someone in your crew. But, okay. We've got five. That's good. Um, okay. So, hey. What's this here? Egg, dragon, mushroom. Oh. Dragon, egg, mushroom. I'm reading everything in the wrong order. Alright. So, where do we have to go? Uh, northwest, which is over here. Oh, okay. There we go. All right. Let's travel this way. Okay. Not down there. So it must be up here. Now, beautiful game. I hear shouting up ahead. Oh, shouting? We should check it out. But up be ahead. Careful. Oh, okay. What's here? Saving. Oh, there they are. Open the bloody gate. Nobody gets in. Zevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! Oh, I'm guessing that's what those goblins you? we saw in that cutscene. Open the gate, Zevlor, now! You let oh, he's here. Zevlor. Where is the druid? Please! There's no time! What druid? Oh. 
the nine hells. Open the gates. What is that? <coughs> that looks like a druid, to be honest, like a warg or something. Oh, oh. Okay. Oh. That looks to be heavy. Shit! Form a line! <laughs> You're already in a line. Damnable roach. Oh, who's this guy? Provoke the blade. Oh. And suffer its sting. Okay, that's a lot of people here. Oh my god, look at the top here. Wow, so many. Ah, it is a warg. So many people here. All right, um, firebolt. Let's firebolt somebody. All right, where is the closest enemy? Oh, here. Nice. All right, um, let's get closer, and let's end your turn. Okay, let's go over here. And what can? Oh, I was like, what? You can turn into a pig? No. Okay, a witch bolt. Okay, let's do that. Situation actions. You have unlocked an action as a result, another ability feature a condition. It will remain at the side of the hot bar until these conditions expire. Where? Here? Okay. What's this? Okay, no. Okay. No worries. Um... So can I do something? Oh, what's this? Oh no. Um, I think that's all we can do. All right, let's end our turn. The only way out is through. Okay, this is me. All right, first let's move. All right, if I do this walk here and then this guy, is that in between? Oh. Oh no. I can do four projections. Nice. All right. Um. Oh, okay. In the mini map, there's three more guys over here. All right. So there's one up here, and can I like use my arrow? Okay. So you're gone. And all right. Let's use the offhand one. There. And. I guess I can do it again. That was the last. All right, awesome. Inside, all of you, more may follow. Open the gate. Okay. Seeking something or someone. All right. Now I'm kind of curious what's down there. However, they're all dead. Um. And these guys are. All right. Grey scroll. Let's get that. Oh no, it's closing. Should get some rest. I need to keep sharp. Uh, does this open up for us? Oh, it does. All right, let's go through. Oh, Emerald Grove. Okay. There are children here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too. Unbelievable! Okay, so they're talking about this druid. Maybe I have to go find it. Okay, where there's one goblin, there's ten. I'm leaving before this horde shows up. Oh, nah. Alright, let's do this one. One fight ended, and now you're picking another. Relax. Tell that to the dead at the gate. Shut it, horns. I'd be lying dead next to the goblins if you'd stalled any longer. My duty is to this camp. Oh, God forbid you risk your precious tail. But I shouldn't be surprised. Foul bloods ain't known for courage. Foul bloods. You see oh. the tiefling's jaw clench. He's about to erupt. All oh, right. Um. Okay. More violence won't bring back those you lost. Stop and think. Okay. Fifteen. Oh man. Luckily for us. We got all of these. All right, twenty-one success. You're right. There's too much at stake. Worried about your precious eyes. 
the both of you. Enough! Squabbling is pointless. The goblins have found us. At least we agree on that. More like, I'm in awe with the, the graphics, you know? Very nice. All right, um, let's go. I'm guessing we got to talk to this guy, right? Zevlor. Forgive that display. Aradin's a blowhard, but that's no cause for me to join him. Thank you for your help out there. I'm Zevlor. Sup, buddy? I'm Ashley. Well met. I should warn you. Visitors are no longer welcome in this grove. Okay, well Whatever we are. <laughs> business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. Oh, okay. I have no quarrels with druids. There have been several attacks by different monsters. The druids blame us outsiders for drawing them here. Nobody's welcome anymore. They've oh, started a ritual okay. to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay. But we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. Alright, um... I need a healer, or this ritual? Alright, yeah, this ritual. Is there no way to convince the druids to stop it? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You, though? I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare. If nothing else. Okay. Um, I'll see what I can do, I guess. I think you should. Yes. No harm in trying the diplomatic route. We'd owe you a great debt. If we're forced to leave now, we won't make it to the city. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense before more lives are lost. Okay, the heart of the grove. So I'm guessing the heart of the grove isn't up here. Um, but there are people up here. Okay, and... Oh, <laughs> I was pressing tab. Okay. Oh, Kagon's belongings. Let's... Why is it red? Would they... Is this Kagon? Uh, is it red because they'll see that I stole it? Alright, alright. I'll be good. Alright, so I'm guessing this is where the heart of the grove is. The hollow. Okay. There's two cows here. Can I talk no, to them as well? Take that back. Right now. Ooh, sounds saucy. Leah, huh? Cal. Cal Kestis. <laughs> and Leah Morgana? I don't remember if that's a name. Roland. Okay, I don't know who that is. Alright. Pels, we can't just leave. They're kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blades and spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. Okay. Um, you should all stay. A single blade could make a difference. Nice, 15. Thank you. It's the right thing to do, and you know it. She's right, Roland. We're better than this. Zergen. Fine, I'll stay too. Lest you both end up with your throat slit by Goblin Blade. Thank you, Roland. I like this, Leo. Okay. Alright, looks like we've done some good here. Um, should we speak with this Roland guy? Guess not. Uh, Very well. Turon? This place is a bloody death trap, not a sanctuary. You should clear off while you can. There's a lot of this kind here. Alright. No hungry ox. No bored ox. Strange ox. Be gone. 
I am hungry. We can talk to animals? Another one. What are you under there then? Ant. Or rocks. What are you talking about? The keepers of this place. They change their form to fit their need. They become birds to hunt on the wing. Bears to tear flesh with teeth. But for me, only oxen, only same old hay. And I cannot even eat it because the horned ones hide their shiny bits inside. Oh. Okay, I'm guessing their swords are in there. Hiding things. Thinking they're clever. Not clever. Sometimes I eat the shiny bits, and they have to go looking for them on the other end. <laughs> okay, so I guess not swords. Hey, there's another creature down there. Weird animation. Alright. This is a strange... Is this a shapeshifter too, then? Ah, you're addressing me? A humble ox. How quaint. There's something strange about the socks. What is it? Yes, 17. Nice. Okay, success. Something's off. This creature isn't what it appears to be. Okay, there's more to you than meets the eye. Care to explain? No. You are incapable. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Fine. I heard the Teflings are going to butcher one of you for food, so your secrets will die with you. Yep, let's do that. Uh, what's this? We can customize the dice? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Uh, I like this scuffed metal. All right. There are mods where you can get, like, more of these, so... Uh, I didn't want to do it because I, I like this purple and black look, so we'll just leave it. 16, yay, we did it. But why do we have two dice? That, I want to know. Alright, let's continue. <laughs> I'd so love to see them try. Oh no, it I'll didn't tell work. You this much. I'm going to Baldur's Gate, with or without the rest of these poor sods. Now, what's that that's Baldur's all I have Gate? To say besides, and I really mean this. Moo. Who? Sounds like Moo fighting for words. You. Moo. Hmm. Fortress, and we're no warriors. Okay. So that didn't work. Can I attack it? Attack. Oh! Oh! Shapeshifter's boon ring. Alright. Okay. Refugees, adventurers, no one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met, and thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. You're Is welcome. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Okay, are you really locking it down? Actually, you know what? I'm looking for a healer. I pray no goblin arrow has grazed you. Netty could put you to rights. She should be with the others in the inner chambers. But I doubt she'll be taking on new patients. The grove will be locked down soon. Okay. Um, so you're really locking down the grove? I know it's drastic, but more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. 
Right. Oh, you're selling Some stuff. Bits and bobs I no longer need. Okay. Oh wow. Sylvanas, okay. guide your path. That's it. All right. So um, we've got some new clothes to choose from. All right. Um, so let's get out of these clothes. H how do I? Okay. There we go. All right. So we've got this here, but oh, see that looks nice. Okay. Um, what about this one? Okay. You know what? This. Now, this black one, I'll keep that. What about this one? Okay, that looks nice too. Um, so let's put that over here. And. Wasn't that like the original? Slightly different. I like that too. Let's keep that here. And last one red. Red looks good too. Alright, so these are all keepers. Actually, I think this one's a keeper too. I like that. Okay. And then I'll sell all these three. And I finally got a shovel so we can dig up some bounties. And we've still got this coin. Ah, uh, you know what? Nah, I like I like this one. Let's leave it as this. Alright. Um Where do we go? Take your time. All right. Oh, I think we have to go down here or something, hey? The Blade of Frontiers. What a thrill for the children. <laughs> They're tough kids. Oh, Smart this guy. Too. The future's in good hands. Okay. Um, let's talk to this guy. Go on. Give me a best shot. <laughs> Not bad. Again. <laughs> I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. All right. Hey there, can I have a word? Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends oh. downward, and his thoughts become oh, yours. You this are guy... the blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. So he's got one of those parasites in him. Yes, and we both carry parasites. Mm. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid. Or so the stories go. A lithid. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so. Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Will it? Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. Who's that? The devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Okay, yeah, who is she? Her name is Karlak. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. <laughs> it's good eye. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship. But the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Okay, let's join forces. I'll help you cast this devil back into the hells. A tadpole feasts on our skulls, and you're signing on to chase devils. I've seen oh my people God. in battle. <laughs> I reckon you are no mere warrior, but a god's damned army. I'd be a fool to let you turn your back. Pledge me your talents, and I'll pledge you mine. I'll presume that's Githyanki for yes. Now let's move. Hmm. Okay. 
The famous Blade of Frontiers in the flesh. Clever, this hero act you've got going. Hero Blade. Name strangers gave me. My friends call me Will. Excellent. Will. If we ever become friends, I'll know what to call you. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> this is going to be a fun journey. <laughs> All right. Okay. Awesome. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. And look at that. We need to level up too. So let's do that. Okay. Okay, here we are. Sorcerer level two. Awesome. So we can learn a new spell. Alright, what are we going to choose? This one. Ice knife. Alright, um... Let's learn... Increase our spell range. And this one. Okay, and our feet. Um... Let's go down here. Uh, telekinetic. We can move things with our mind. And what's the highest? Charisma. So let's do that. And hit accept. Awesome. Okay. Okay, nice. Now everyone's leveled up. Let's continue. And again. Swing, swing. I doubt they're down here. Oh, who are these guys? Oh, Leon, Roland, and them. Okay. Oh. Wait. for discussion? Wait, there's a rat. Can we talk to it? Stay back, or else! That's weird. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Just get back! Ow! Oh, my tooth! Oh, I see something there. It's the front one. I chipped it on the evil thing. What evil thing? In the box. Follow me, I'll show you. Okay. Um, let's go. Man, the animals are... Okay. Not everyone subscribes to what is mine is yours, it seems. Oh. But... We need to go in. Oh look, there's somebody in there. Um... You've been warned. Can we talk to you? By Mordai's eyes. Another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. Absolutely. Kalir, Get out of the a way. Formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? Yes, and I suggest you do as she says. <laughs> oh wow, he actually bows down. Lower. <laughs> uh, we'll just 
wait. Yeah. You saw another gith. Where? On the road to Baldur's Gate, N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. The map. Show me. Okay. Up. You can keep your innards. <laughs> By the dead gods. Yeah, but I want to get into the gift so brutal. Brutal. I want to get into the, the house, man. Veins. I was positively gentle. <laughs> I guess so. Um, but how do we get in here? God, deliver me. I'm sure there's a s another way in, eh? There's got to be. Um, looks yeah. like we need to talk to her. The locals prove compliant. A useful trait. I warned you, didn't I? You ought to reconsider keeping her around before she causes real trouble. Alright, so what comes next? The tea sling was clear. If there are Githyanki west of here, that must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. Teethling? Is that what you said? I am unfamiliar with the... Well, I shall not say culture. Custom, perhaps. You will educate me on matters of this... Fey run. <laughs> uh, all right. Um, yeah, let's just leave, okay? All right. Now, trying to find a way in here. Um, um, maybe in here. Oh wow! Sun melon. No. Okay, I'll take that goal though. Um, but how do I get in here? Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's gone. Okay. Um, it's locked. All right. Um, uh, that doesn't seem to help. No. Okay. Not sure how to get in, so let's talk to this person. Goblins, druids. This grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. No. Oh. Okay. Is that um, everything? But that means I'm I stealing if I open those. Hey, what happens if she can't see me? Nah, no, she's staying here. All right. Um. Yeah. Looks like I'm gonna have to do this later. Unless I've got a skeleton key. Can I use this? Oh! Okay. Alright, looks like we, we can go in now. Stop! This place is off limits! Leave! Okay. Um, don't worry, I'm here to help. Alright, need a ten. A one! Hmm. Says success. Damn it! Was inventory today? I'm sorry. Nerves are shot after the attack. Do what you gotta do. Sorry if I don't show you around. Need a hand? I just fall back down. Legs are as steady as a falls. Bloody potion! Potion? Uh, where did you get this potion? From the old lady in the cave. The one with the lotions and potions. To her credit, it worked. I'm as strong as a bugbear. And fearless. Of course she also warned of side effects. Should have listened. Now I'm stuck guarding crates. Okay. Um... You must feel pretty useless. And then some. I just hope this wears off soon. Okay, um. To 
Let's talk to the rat yeah, then. The evil things in the chest. Oh, but we can't get to it because she's in the way. Oh, okay. All right, no worries. Um, at least this thing is unlocked, so uh, we could do this a little bit later, I guess. But out of my way, Shadowheart. Yeah, everything is considered stealing, pretty much, except for the books. And yeah, I don't want books. All right. Okay, let's get out of here. So, let's go this way. Oh, wow. Statue's glowing. Alright. And let's go down here. What's happening here? Hold out your hand, lady. Let me show you something. He's gonna steal, isn't he? Oh, a ring. Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. Um, no. That was a fancy you trick. You haven't seen anything yet, lady. Go on, take the ring and watch your fortune change. Um, how about... Mm, yes, yeah, slide a hand. Make the ring disappear. Alright, critical success. Nice. Weeping, bleeding hells! Okay, maybe you don't need extra luck. But since you're already holding the thing, call it heads or tails. Alright, heads. Even though it's a 50 50 shot. Heads it is! Hey, I got it right. See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheat, too. Interested? <laughs> uh, no. Uh, return the ring and leave. Yeah. I can feel a swindler happening. Uh, let's oh, talk to this hi. guy now. Hi. I don't have any money or anything to sell. My p partner does that. Okay, so what's your side of the business? What? Um, I'm the guard. So don't steal anything. I'm watching you. Okay. All right. Um. Oh, there's a crowd here, so Please something's happening. Through. Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn, and you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back. Oh, let me through, Ragrasham, or I'll rip your damn throat out. <gasps> oh, they're the druids. Okay. Um, okay. So let's talk to this one. Carl Magrin, give her a chance. You, get back! Okay. If it weren't by me, you'll be overrun by goblins by now. I'll go where I Kick please. Back. Force my hand and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Oh, I understand. You. Apparently, Corga wants to see you. Go ahead. Mm. Okay, nice. Alright, so we're able to go. Hey. Hello, my good man. Ah, my good friend. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Okay. Ask your questions. Glory. Now then. How would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities. Is this guy a bard? You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Just tell him exactly how it is. Goblins were of rare, jam-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. A myth weaver. 
This man has no respect. A myth weaver. <laughs> so a storyteller. They had marching in the rear. Was it of the brass or silver variety? <laughs> it was brass, no doubt about it. Witness mistook obvious silver dragon for brass. Last question, then you'll be quite what? free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Yeah, they called out the name like a war cry. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh curious. Oh, curious indeed. This I've guy... interrogated one, a captive in this very camp. Oh. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal. The Absolute. Why does it sound like I've heard that before? Alright, goblin superstition, not worth the ink and parchment. Ah, but is superstition all? These goblins are informed by a kind of strategy anathema to their kind. I, for one, intend to get to the bottom of it. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, in fact. If you'll excuse me, I ought not to dawdle. This guy's gonna get himself killed. Absolutely. Okay, be careful. Goblins aren't known for their mercy. Never you mind. Who needs mercy when you've a quick tongue, hmm? And an invisibility potion stashed in your back pocket. Okay. Until we meet again. I was going to say the orcs will, like, cut you up and take your tongue out, but if you've got an invisibility potion, nice. And were you talking to this bear here? Just a moment. This man is recording my story. I am far from home. As the okay. colourful man starts scribbling, the bear sneaks a quick look at the page. His brow furrows. Incomprehensible squiggles surround a crude sketch. A bear disemboweling a clutch of tieflings. Yeah, that guy's not listening to anything. Alright, um, what's happening here? Oh, this is how they're doing it. All right. Um, and what's with this sleeping bear? I'm sleeping. All right. So he's preventing us from going up the ladder. Okay. Uh, throw a fish next to the elevator. Huh? What's that? Hmm. Okay. Awesome. So we can go up now. All right. Let's pull this lever. Okay, and... Oh, there's the assassin. Okay. Let's take a look. Okay. Oh. What's going on? He managed to free himself? But how? Okay. You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone poorly. But you're not here for heroics, are you? Avernus's stench is all over your skin. Let me guess. Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. But too bad. I earned it, fair and square. I've got a soul coin. All right, uh, let's go with this. Deception. You got me. Hand the coin over and I'll be on my way. Wow, 49. Success. That bloody Irenes. Devils just can't stand to lose. Here. Now go back to the pit that made you. Okay. So we got another soul coin. Um... Now, I'm sure we can... Okay, let's get this. Uh, what's this? Let's grab that. Okay. Alright, um, I'm sure we can talk to the dead. Alright. Here we go. The corpse has nothing to say. Okay, looks like um, he's got nothing to say. Alright, that's a shame. Alright, um, now let's take a look at our map. Oh, we gotta go over here and over 
there, it looks like. Um, what's happening here? Come on, Rick. And now what? We dig a hole and be done with him? We... We could say a prayer. We should have time for that. Yeah. Okay, um... Yeah. Alright, maybe I can talk to the dead with this guy. The corpse regards you lifelessly. Okay, so... Who are you? Cannon! Okay... What happened Killed. to you? Because you're dead, my friend. Okay. Uh, where do you keep your valuables? <laughs> take much in bedroll. Okay. It's in the bedroll, I'm guessing. Alright, um. Alright, um, who killed you? There were goblins. Oh, this guy was at the top. Aradin yeah, okay. Followed. Okay, uh, where are you from? I. We. From Elturel. Left. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Okay, so I'm guessing we can only ask five questions. Yeah, that would be good. Okay. All right. No worries. All right, let's continue. Okay, guys. So after all that, um, I think we are here. Stone door. Okay. I'm sorry. Have you lost your senses, Corgan? What happened? Ooh, snake. Oh wow. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Corga. She's just a A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Okay, thief, poison, what's the girl's crime? Girl? You mean parasite. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Oh, wow. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Alright, let's read Kogar's mind. Alright, need a 13. Nice, 16. Halsim is gone. I am first druid now. I will take control and prove my authority. Oh, that's why. Alright, you've proven your authority. Now prove your mercy. Fair words. Child. Take to the others word of my grace. Sivasif, Tila, to me. Sivasif. <laughs> it hurts. Whoa. Thank you, Korga. What Master hurts? Halsin, Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. Okay. All right. Um, you guys need want me to talk to you. So, um, first of all, let's talk to Gale because I really want to know what Shadowheart's thinking. Tiring business, isn't it? All this traveling and adventuring. Why don't we take a little break? Hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest. Gives me a chance to talk to you about something. Well, rather important. Okay, rather important, no less. All right, go ahead. We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't we? Yep, maybe an hour. Some perils, 
overcame some obstacles. Ever since you were kind enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate remarkable guile and courage. The way you diffused the tension between Zevlor and Aradin. The way you got Korga to release the girl. In short, I've grown to trust you. Oh, nice. All right. Uh, that's very gratifying to hear. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul, except for my cat. You see, I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. Okay. I'm curious. Uh, what kind of condition? The specifics are rather personal, but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with. Though not without some effort. Does he turn into like what a, it comes down to a werewolf this. or something? Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. Okay. Your illness causes you to consume raw magic. Gonna need the details. I can say no more on the matter. Not now, anyway. Just trust me when I say it's all of vital importance. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact. And before we were abducted. It's only a matter of time before my craving returns. That is why I turn to you. I need you to help me find magic items to consume. It is vital. Dare I say it? Critical. Oh, is that what's the thing on his neck? Okay, um, where do you suggest we find these artifacts? As luck would have it, Faerun is full of them. Though I do feel obliged to point out that items of power tend to be in the hands of the powerful. Oh, be so we gotta kill people. Or great cost. Okay, I expect as much. Don't worry, I'll be happy to help. Splendid. Bit of boldness will serve us well. I'm sure we won't have to look very far to find what I need. Faerun overflows with magic-infused treasure. I know the allure magic artifacts hold. I understand their value and their power. All this to say, I understand the sacrifice I ask of you. But if I may be so bold, it's for a very good cause indeed. I hope I can count on you. Yeah, did you see those? Um, all down his throat and everything? Yeah, I think that's what's consuming him. All right, Shadow Heart's turn. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's yeah, your just hand. Clear the air about that now. Okay. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. Then why does it glow? It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least, in case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. Oh my God! Everyone's got something they need to live with. All right, how badly does it hurt? Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Okay. Um, are you sure it's not connected to the tadpoles? Positive. You can trust me on that. Okay. Um, all right, so what's the story with the odd little artifact you have? There's no story. None that you're entitled to hear, anyway. Oh, oh geez. forget you ever saw it. Okay. Uh, let's leave then, eh? Okay. Alright, and here we are. And this thing is glowing. Can we go to it or anything? No? Let's check our map. Um, speak with Kagar. She's over there. Alright, um... So, Kega's where? Over here? Servants' quarters? Am I going the right way? Nope. Okay. Alright, so here's Kega. Let's speak Go with on. her. Say it. You think I'm a monster? She reminds Monster. me of that Too that kind. elf in um, a demon more like in The Witcher, the TV show, eh? Um, protecting your own. Sometimes cruelty is required. First you urge grace, then you speak truth. You surprised me twice over. 
A shame the grace period ends. The Viper's fangs have been bared. She must guard her brood. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. Okay, Zephyla believes his people will perish on the road. And mine perish if he stays. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Zevlor. Offer to oh, guide the Outlanders okay. out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Okay. Um, then it seems I need to speak with Zephlor. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander Rot cleansed, and the Grove forever shrouded. Okay, guys, and looks like we finally found Nettie. Alright, that took a while. I see you. Just give me a moment. Anything a moment. I can do to help? This may be cat. No. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? All right, I'm looking for Nettie. Yep. You found her, but I still don't know what she can do for you. Healing as soon as possible. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. Alright, no good way of putting it, but uh, I have this tadpole in my head. A tadpole? A mind flare tadpole? I, I do. You know anything about them? Can you help? I, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. Okay, We need to go. be quick. This way. Oh, was there a sacred door? Ooh. Okay. Let's go through. Hey. There's something in that vessel. Something Take in there. Take a closer look. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Oh. Okay. Uh, the drow and I have the same kind of parasite. Seems so. Give Master Halson a right start. Okay. It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. To find out what was happening. A pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. You don't have to be here for this. I'm interested in the procedure, actually. Please, go ahead. All right. Let's see what we can do. Okay, thank you. I'll take anything that can help. Of course. Now, tell me what's been happening. Any symptoms? Strange events? I can merge my mind with anyone else that's infected. Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. Okay, mind flare ship. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look. What's that sound? You've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. True. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Mm, okay. I thought you could cure me. What about that branch of yours? The thorn? Coated in a fatal toxin. It was a last resort. In case I couldn't trust you. Oh, I you're gonna prick me with it. Only a way out. I'm sorry for oh, seeing you. Okay. But I had to be sure you weren't a threat before I told you everything. Now, 
Do I have your word or not? Um, all right, I swear. I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them. Oh, someone's trying coming. To figure out what the hell was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Wait, what do you mean we should be changing? Mind flayers reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms and a new mind flayer is born. The thing in your skull, though, it's different to anything in our records. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Oh. Okay. So, you think it's only a matter of time? Could be. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. Oh. Okay, um, so go and get him. I've sent birds to find him, but the place is rotten with goblins. And if my birds can't get close, what chance do I have? You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? Alright, I'll go find this person. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All okay. I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Okay. Alright guys, and on that note, that concludes this episode of Baldur's Gate 3. Now, I quite enjoyed this game more than I actually thought that I would. And I think it's all got to do with how immersive the world is. You know, the lore and everything like that. Especially because of the cutscenes and all the multiple choices that you have that you can decide. It wasn't just like one or two different options. You had like three or four at, at least, you know. Now, if you did enjoy this episode, guys, I've only got one simple request. Please like and comment down below and I'll make an, a second episode. Now, if I manage to get 10 likes, there will be an episode two. If not, that's fine. I'll, I'll play something else. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. And as always, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you next video. Until then, guys, take care. Bye.